And welcome back to Ozarks Live. The Star Wars universe is bringing so many new shows, movies, and animated series. Yep, coming from a galaxy far, far away. And here with the breakdown is Entertainment Tonight's Nichelle Turner. Nichelle. May the fourth be with you, Joy and Cammy. From two Mandalorian spinoffs to the return of fan favorites, I'm telling you everything we know about new Star Wars. Ewan McGregor will return as Obi Wan Kenobi for a Disney Plus series that is now in production. Hayden Christensen will join him as Anakin slash Darth Vader. The story is very closely guarded, but Ewan did tell us this. What's going on with the Obi Wan Kenobi series? The scripts are really, really good. As you can see, we're getting ready. We're building stages. We're rehearsing. We're training. We're trying costumes. We're doing everything to make sure we do the best show. Diego Luna gave a behind-the-scenes look at his new series, Andor, set to release next year. He's reprising his role as Cassian from Rogue One. I'm really excited having the chance to explore Cassian. It's really fun to go out on a set that is emulating something you like so much. The Mandalorian's Rosario Dawson spin-off series for her character, Ahsoka, is in development. And in December, The Book of Boba Fett will hit Disney+. Plus. But if you need your Star Wars fix right now... What else you got? Give me more! The animated series The Bad Batch just hit the streamer in time for Star Wars Day. Yeah! And tune into ET tonight for my emotional interview with Angelina Jolie. She's opening up about her darkest days and why she felt broken. Don't miss it. For Entertainment Tonight, I'm Nichelle Turner.